Introduction It is exam time. Ben is revising mathematics. The topic he chose today to revise is addition and subtraction involving four digit numbers. Friends, we all know addition and subtraction involving numbers. Let us learn to add and subtract four digit numbers along with Ben. Objectives at the end of this lesson, you'll be able to add four-digit numbers, subtract four-digit numbers, estimate addition answer using number line, estimate using curved shifting. Addition of four-digit numbers. The first problem that Ben picks to solve is to add given numbers 4541 and 2316. He starts solving the question by writing the numbers in these lines. Remember that we begin adding from ones. So here the addition is 7. Now we move to add the tens. 4 plus 1 is equal to 5. Similarly, we add the numbers under place hundred and thousands. The numbers we get are 8 and 6 respectively. So, given numbers 4541 and 2316 when added is equal to 6857. Addition with regrouping. Let's try the addition of 5327 and 3265. We start by adding values at one's place, which is 7 plus 5 is equal to 12. Write 2 below in the ones line and write 1 above in the tens line. Next we move to add the tens. 2 plus 6 plus 1 is equal to 9. Write 9 below in the tens line. Now we add hundreds. 3 plus 2 is 5. Write 5 below in hundreds line. Similarly add thousands. We get the answer as 8. Therefore, addition of 5327 and 3265 is equal to 8592. Subtraction of four-digit numbers. Friends, Ben has now moved to solve subtraction. Let us subtract 3212 from 6543. Write the numbers in the respective columns. We start subtraction from one's column. 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. Subtract tens. 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. Similarly, subtract hundreds and thousands. 5 minus 2 is 3 and 6 minus 3 is 3. So, 6543 minus 3212 is 3331. Subtraction with borrowing. It's time to learn subtraction involving borrowing. Subtract 3549 from 6583. We again start from 1's column. Since 3 is smaller than 9, so we will borrow 110 from 8. Therefore, 3 will become 13 and 8 will become 7. Subtract 9 from 13. We get 4. Subtract 10's. 7 minus 4 is 3. Similarly, we now subtract hundreds. 5 minus 5 is 0. Subtract thousands. 6 minus 3 is equal to 3. So, 6583 minus 3549 is equal to 3034. Estimation using number line 1. Let us try something interesting. On screen you see a number line from 0 to 10. Can you guess the position of number 5 on this line? Yes, it will be in the middle of the line. The position of number 3 will be between 0 and 5 and number 7 will be between 5 and 10. Let us add 3 and 6. By adding 3 and 6, we get 9. And the position of 9 will be near to 10. Estimation using number line 2. Let us now consider a bigger number line from 0 to 100. Can you guess the position of number 20 on this line? It will be near 0 or towards 100. Yes, 
it will be near zero. What about number 70? Yes, number 70 will be near 100. Subtracting 20 from 70, we get 50. And the position of 50 will be the center of the line. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. Adding four-digit numbers. Subtracting four-digit numbers. Estimation using number line.